from uh, from Karen Carmen to play this one. So this one's dedicated to you guys, to the Tom family. Oh yeah, they're all here. <laughs> Bye. We don't have to drive your car. Thank mm -hmm. you. 
worked this really hard for the show. It means a lot to me that you're all here. I put a lot of time and effort into my set, and I think it shows. But thanks for showing up, Anthony. I mean, Mike. I mean, Z. 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 He was an hour late. He was an hour late, also. Best funeral all week. Thank you. <laughs> Um, I have really tough stands, okay. <laughs> this song's called The Dog at the Party Won't Look at Me. about Catholicism, not in a creepy way, in like the ancient way where like before shit got, before Real. stuff got weird, Come on, guys. canceled or whatever. Canceled? It's called St. Francis Loves All the Animals. Oh, well it's happening. Sorry, we just sprung this on you, I forgot. Thank you. This for me. This is like a really big day for me. <laughs> Do you need to sing in the mic too, or are you just gonna play? Come on. No. Stand here. Uh, no, buddy. <laughs> There's nothing to eat up here.
this side and you can kind of go on and on, and on that side. Okay. There we go. I'm really good at music. <laughs> How much better at playing guitar you are than me? Or how much worse of a person? Both. <laughs> this song is about Siberian trappers. What a hard life they live. Let's sing about it. <laughs>
break your heart and I keep it buried. Oh, I won't mind the way that I my body will freeze over for you. Bless you in my solitary life. Your name, the only prayer I'd abide. As I'd sooner die alone than let the coffee grow cold before I see you coming home to me. I remember this. Bicycles, and then I'll play one song about dying with some friends. Yeah. I'll sing a song about dying. The song will be sung with my friends. Twilight! <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> oh, yeah, it's Twilight weekend. Dying the song's about Twilight. Dying on bicycles with friends. <laughs> the song is called Neon Light. It's also on my new album. Stream it on Tidal today. <laughs> This town has so many bars And we ride past them on our bikes We are soaked in neon light We cut through it like a knife And it leaves me blind Oh, it leaves me blind It's called Everyone I Know Will Die. It's um, sung by me and also my friend Lucy and Nick if they want to sing with me. Yeah. Is Nick here? I don't see him. If not, that's cool. 
Better off without him, man. <clears throat> no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> That's my resent. There's it! Forget what I just said. <laughs> I was just talking about how reliable you are. And what a good friend. The only thing more reliable than me is the timing. Water. <laughs> um, so I got the one mic, but you guys are like really okay. loud. No doubt. <laughs> but I'm very proud of this song because we got it on the Nightville podcast. Woo! Yeah, I was super proud of that um, because the submission deadline was New Year's Eve at midnight, and it was like 11:59. I was like, Patrick, master my song. <laughs> He's like, I've never mastered this song. I'm like, figure it out, and he did it. Woo! Woo! Yeah. Yeah. Daddy. yeah. It did really good, and then we got on the podcast, and now I'm famous. So <laughs> that's how it happens. Um, so yeah, here we go. <clears throat> Everyone I know is aching with the ghost of what I know is right. Yeah. And everyone I know is aching in their bones from what I can describe. I'm not gonna play guitar. You're welcome. Uh, Patrick's gonna play the computer. Oh, are you not even ready for this? We did practice. We did practice today. Um, so my album, in large part, was uh, produced by Patrick, which means that I was lazy and I made Patrick do all the work. The result was a lot of the songs sound way better than they should, um, and it's all because of him, really. Um, because if you read the flagpole recently, uh, <laughs> you know that um, this is my last show ever. Um, catch me May 16th at the Foundry, it's gonna be great. Uh, I guess it's called Melting Point, but I'll be dead then. Uh, but I was very burned out um, with my own songs, and I hate the sound of my own voice. And I don't like playing shows or touring, so really, where, where, 
where do I fit um, <laughs> in, the, in the music world? Don't know, I, I ask myself that a lot. So, does anyone know? <laughs> Thank you. Put my music in your Target commercials. Um, this, this song, um, this song is um, about some bad teens. Uh, my friend Lauren invited me. We were gonna start a band called Bad Teens about teens doing bad things, and I was like, "Oh, I'll, I'll write some songs about teens being really bad," and they were very sad. So um, didn't work out because I was never young, and I don't know what that's like. But uh, this song is called "The Last Mall in Town." Stuntman in the house in Endgame. This song is dedicated to you. It's called Superhero Movies. It's about binge watching television and uh, feeling good about your life. We watched Are You Afraid of the Dark?
my boyfriend. <laughs> My goal is to break even. You can help me reach this dream. <laughs> Thanks for coming. <laughs> thank you. I'm thinking so. Um, and thank you, Anthony Apero. Um, and thank you, Vision Board. Buy their stuff on the internet. Um, can you buy your stuff on the internet? No. <laughs> Anthony has a real job, so he doesn't need our pity money. He doesn't need to sell merch to live. He's wearing a onesie. <laughs> anyway, this is the roast of Anthony Apero. He's divorced. Thank you. I'm for us. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>